Naledi Soweto heightened with tension following the shock deaths of five young children. Emotions are high amid the ongoing police investigations. My heart is very broken because of these guys come very far from where they come from. Then they come and kill our children and we support them. Like each and everyone supports them because they are cheap. This should come over the inspector. I understand that the inspector to the inspector each and every He says this spaza shops should have inspectors to inspect each and every product that they sell. The heartbroken parents and outraged community are demanding answers. This latest suspected food poisoning incident has again raised concerns and renewed calls for the enforcement of food safety compliance, especially in spaza shops. I've warned them, I've met with the spaza shop owners nationally and actually with their national leadership. And I said that according to what the environmental you know, health, the practitioners have, have, have found on their investigation that majority of the spaza shop do not comply in terms of the food, you know, the Health and Safety Food Act. So they need to start having a quality management system and a disaster management system. City of Johannesburg MMC for Health and Social Development, Enima Kafula, says they have conducted their inspections. So yes, the inspections have been done. Like I'm saying, um, when we do inspection as the health inspectors or, or the people responsible for inspection, their role is to come and perform the overall inspection and check if really the shops do comply with their regulations. If they don't comply, they either can issue um, a notice or a fine. If it comes to a, fair, um, a point that the shop should be closed, we also involve um, the JNPD or SEPs because they are the ones who have to enforce bylaws. Police Minister Senzum Kunu says intelligence should be deployed to check the compliance of all spaza shops in Gauteng. We can't um, uh, just leave it to parents and leave it to schools. We just have to do the profile of all these areas and uh, uh, the owners of uh, these, these businesses and so on while checking each and every incident. Surely we are going to get to the bottom of this and uh, deal with it decisively and once and for all. The mass memorial service of the five children is expected to take place on Friday while the mass funeral service is expected to take place on Sunday in Naledi Hall in Soweto. Puseletomokwena, SABC News, Soweto in Naledi.